Hello? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Where are you? Could it be? Yeah, I didn't touch it. There's something that, that I want you to do for me. Uh, no problem. I won't be up. I'll go to you some bottom. And I'll be now. Yes. I'm going to go to you. I'm going to go to you. I'll pay you. No problem. 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 
I'll call you back. Let me talk to my guy. No problem. All right, let's meet in the evening. Okay. Okay, but guys, could you see GP Moish? Could you guys do the four cam? I would talk to him. I told her to run the Pama evenings. Oh, but down payment, she was out. I had to tell her down payment, or my longer talk at dealing. I got to push us on Sky Never Marit. Oh, eh, you go with a guy who said, Go to one point of the world. Eh, go to my winning diamond guy. Eh, so to feel it to a dealing, I was worker. Table fin. Oh, 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 All right, sharp. What's the color of your blood? And what's the color of her blood? Mm -hmm. 
if, 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 if it is this Judas, look at him. Guys, <laughs> we're very different. Just look at her. There is nothing that you are very different. Are this thing what? must not continue in this class, otherwise, I'll call your parents. Okay, but that's not the problem. They just have done was remove her, remove her from this class. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Yes. I'll call the principal to expel most of you people in here. If this thing, if this nonsense continues in this class, who who does that come and sit here? Who does that to be mentioned? Angela, from today I want you to be sitting here in front. Okay? Hey everyone, quiet. Everyone, quiet. Everyone, why today it's uh. You'll see when going. Don't even talk to her. I am not a stranger to the dark. Hide away, they say, because we don't want your broken parts. Learn to be ashamed of all my scars. John Chiti. I'm a musician and I'm also the executive director for the Albinism Foundation of Zambia. This is an organization that promotes the welfare of people with albinism in Zambia. The organization was formed in 2008, so this is like our 11th year. People who are born with albinism face a number of challenges. the health challenges and also social challenges. Uh, health challenges have to do with their skin, and their eyesight. Because they lack melanin in the skin, people with albinism get uh, sunburned easily, uh, which also results in cancer. Their skin is easily damaged by the sun, and uh, many of them are prone to skin cancer, and many of them die from skin cancer. People with albinism are short-sighted, so they can't see from far. So you have problems where a child is not able to read on the board in class, uh, they are not able to read books in small letters and uh, they also become uncomfortable when there is too much light. So all those are some of the health challenges that they face. And then when, when we come to the society, they are rejected by their families and the society. They are discriminated against uh, and also they are mistreated. They are misunderstood and actually there are a lot of beliefs that the society has put on people with albinism. And uh, if that is not enough, they are also killed uh, for their body parts. So all these problems happen because they are born with albinism, which is a genetic condition that is passed on, on them from their parents. Some of the beliefs and the misconceptions the society has put on albinism are that um, albinism is contagious, they think that uh, someone can have albinism if they interact, if they see an albino. Uh, 
Uh, another belief is that uh, albino body parts can cure diseases or make someone rich. Because people think albinism is contagious, they tend to shun away from albinos. They don't interact with them because they fear that they may turn into you know, a person with albinism. So there is that separation between the albinism community and the uh, general public. And then also because of the belief that uh, albino body parts can be used to make wealth, albinos are killed. Um, they are hunted for their body parts, they are attacked and they are killed. So these beliefs affect the society, the albinism community, in a way that in the end the people with albinism don't enjoy their human rights like everybody else. They can't move freely because they can be attacked anytime. They have inferiority complex. They look down on themselves. They think, well, they cannot live as everybody else. So all these beliefs have come to affect the albinism community in this way. The initiative by DMS to sensitize the public on albinism using film it's a good initiative and it is highly recommended. And uh, we appreciate uh, their interest in trying to promote the welfare of people with albinism. Um, albinism is, uh, is, is something that many people don't want to associate themselves with. So this is an example to all media houses and other corporate uh, uh, organizations that they should take a step like DMS in whatever they are doing, be it in production, in their programs, they should think of this community, the albinism community, that it is also a community that can, they can include in their programs. So we highly recommend the partnership that we have with uh, DMS and uh, yeah, we, we appreciate them and we hope that uh, through this project, you know, it can help in raising awareness on albinism and uh, in turn that will help in the unity that should be there between the albinism community and uh, the general public.